subscribe to Nika TV and press the bell icon to make sure you never miss an update from us. Hey guys, welcome back to Nika TV. I'm Akriti and this video is in collaboration with Nika TV. Now in today's video, I'm going to show you a skincare routine specifically for clogged pores. Now before I get started with the video, let me tell you that the first two techniques that I'll be sharing with you guys in this video is something that I do on a weekly or max to max bi-weekly basis. I do not do these every single day at all. And if I'm doing the first technique, let's say on a Monday, then I'll do the second technique on let's say Wednesday or Thursday as in when my skin needs it. And the last technique that I'll be sharing with you guys is something that you can include in your daily skincare routine. So now that you guys know that, let's get started. Okay, so my first technique is going to be oil cleansing. And no, it's not your regular oil cleansing which is a part of your two-step cleansing routine where you use oil cleanser to remove your makeup. Yes, that is amazing, but what I'm talking about here exactly is oil cleansing for about 10 to 15 minutes to kind of get rid of all the oil plugs and everything that is most likely clogging your pores. Quick fun fact before we proceed further, your skin barrier is actually made up of fatty acids and oil cleansing is using the same principle that oil dissolves oil and we already know that oil and water don't mix. So what ends up happening here is something called as emulsification where you're cleansing balm or cleansing oil. So any product that you're actually going to use for oil cleansing already has surfactants in them. So the oil binds to the surfactants in the product and then the surfactants bind to the water and that way you finally get rid of everything that is on your face so from makeup gunk just anything that is clogging your pores excess sebum and all of those nasty things so what i personally like to do especially on days when i've got plenty of time so let's say on a weekend i would go with one of my favorite cleansing balms or cleansing product in general uh, and at the moment it is the palmer's coconut cleansing balm I would gently start massaging this on my skin and I would mainly try to focus it on the areas where I have clogged pores. So for me, it is my T-zone, especially my nose. My nose gets clogged very, very quickly, very easily. So I try to focus the product especially on that area and I kid you not you guys the first two times that I did this technique I actually saw like oil plugs coming out of my skin which was so surprising because I have been oil cleansing for almost one one and a half years now uh, ever since I started wearing full face of makeup I knew how important oil cleansing was but that was only to get rid of my makeup effectively I never really thought that using an oil cleansing product like this for an extended period of time can be actually a very good Good, gentle and effective way of unclogging your pores. Now if you have oily skin and acne prone skin, I understand that most of us are really apprehensive of putting any oil based product on our skin but let me tell you this is one of my favorite techniques to use when I want to unclog my pores but I'm also kind of breaking out. So in the clip also that you'll be watching where I have demoed the product you can see that I actually had like two major breakouts but because this is so gentle you're actually just using the pressure from your fingertips and massaging it on your skin this is one of my favorite ways to unclog my pores when I'm actually breaking out so for the demo part how I exactly like to use this technique is I like to go with absolutely clean skin I advise that you don't do this over like a full face of makeup on like absolutely get rid of your makeup uh, clean your face with a face wash do your whole double cleansing technique and then go with your cleansing balm or cleansing oil if you're using one and start you know massaging it on your skin for a good 10 to 15 minutes and if you are doing this for the first time and let's say that your pores are absolutely completely clogged I can promise that you are going to feel something gritty on your skin as you are massaging it and that is the most satisfying feeling ever and then you can also see like a few oil plugs coming onto your hands which is so satisfying to watch and if you ask me my favorite part about this technique is how glowy your skin looks you actually get the glow from within sort of a look without any makeup or anything because of course you're circulating your face for a good 10 to 15 minutes you're giving it a massage which increases the blood flow to your face and you get the best glow from within look and I absolutely love that about this technique. Now my second favorite technique for clogged pores is chemical exfoliation. If you are someone who loves physical exfoliation and if it works for you, there's nothing really wrong with it. But in my opinion, at least for my skin, I find that chemical exfoliation just works and it works the best when I compare it with physical exfoliation. Especially if a product has salicylic acid or some sort of BHA in it. 
So the one that I've been currently obsessing over is this one by Dot & Key. This is their Hydro Peel Glow Potion. You guys can see I'm almost halfway done with this. Now this one has 10% AHA and 2% BHA and this is a leave-on treatment that you apply on your skin, leave it on for 10 minutes and then wash it off. This is not a serum even though it looks like one. Now if you are looking for a product for chemical exfoliation, look for something which specifically has BHA in it because BHA in specific salicylic acid is supposed to penetrate your skin and really help in unclogging those pores. And so I have been absolutely loving this product for the same reason. I apply it on my skin, leave it on for 10 minutes, wash it off and I'm left with the most smoothest skin of all times. I don't have any texture, any bumpiness, just absolutely smooth, unclogged pores looking skin. Of course, this also has 10% AHA, which stands for alpha hydroxy acid. And AHAs are also great for just unclogging your pores and exfoliating your skin on a deeper level. So this product is a win-win situation for your clogged pores. Now if you're wondering if you have to do chemical exfoliation immediately after you're done with oil cleansing or let's say on the same day, I would say it is absolutely not required because oil cleansing, the technique that we just spoke about, itself is a great way of getting rid of your clogged pores, any congestion, uh, gunk and all of the bad stuff from your skin. So no, you do not need to directly proceed with chemical exfoliation immediately after that step. So if I have oil cleansed, let's say on Monday, then I would go with this product, a chemical exfoliation step, let's say on a Thursday or whenever my skin requires it. So please do not overdo it and you definitely don't have to club the two techniques the same day. Now my last technique is something that you can include in your everyday skincare routine and this really ensures that you are regulating or more so controlling the oil production on your face or on your skin. So if you are taking care of that, I think you can already guess that in turn you are not going to have as much clogged pores and just congested skin overall. So this step is more of a preventive step and of course you get a lot of other benefits from this particular ingredient and if you have not already guessed it then I'm talking about niacinamide. Especially if you have oily and acne prone skin then niacinamide is an active ingredient which is actually clinically proven to regulate oil production on your skin and also it has other skincare benefits like it helps to decrease the pigmentation on your skin and overall just keep your skin really healthy and balanced. So the two that I have here is the Mama Earth Skin Correct Face Serum with Niacinamide and Ginger Extract and the second one that I have here with me is the Physician's Formula Skin Booster Vitamin Shot and this one also has a derivative of ascorbic acid but the second ingredient in both of these is niacinamide. Now if you are absolutely new to using niacinamide, you have never used it before then I would suggest you this one. This is from Physician's Formula again and this is their Vitamin Shot. So why it's called as a Vitamin Shot is because this you can mix in with your moisturizer or basically you can use it in any step of your skincare routine you don't necessarily have to use it as the first product on your skin so this is a much more gentler form of niacinamide but of course if you are a pro you can also go with this one from mama earth so how i personally like to use it is if i'm using this one then i love mixing it with my moisturizer and applying it all over my face and if i'm using this one then this is the first product that goes onto my skin after toner and I apply this and follow it up with my moisturizer and sunscreen. And the best part about niacinamide is that you don't have to limit yourself only by using this in your PM routine. You can include niacinamide usage in your AM skincare routine, so that's great. So those are all of the techniques and the steps that I've been following in my skincare routine. And I have started to see a major, major change. My pores don't get clogged as much. if. For some reason any makeup product or a primer or something has done that to me i always have these two techniques to back it up so my chemical exfoliation and then um you know oil cleansing for like 10 to 15 minutes actually helps a lot and i no more feel the need to go with a physical exfoliant and physically get rid of it because yes it does get rid of the dead skin cell but not necessarily the deep seated clogged pores that you have and finally that's it from my end don't forget to like and share this video also don't forget to subscribe to Nika tv and i will see you in my next video bye bye